Chu Yu Yu was born in 1930 on the east coast of China. Aged 15, Chu contracted tuberculosis and had to take a two-year break from her studies. Fortunately for humanity, Chu's illness inspired her to go into the medical sector. After graduating from Peking University Medical School in 1955, Chu began studying traditional Chinese medicine. In the late 1960s, new strains of malaria became resistant to existing treatments. The global medical community struggled to respond, and the disease quickly spread, killing millions of people. Outbreaks were especially disastrous among combatants in the Vietnam War. In 1964, malaria caused four to five times more medical disabilities among U.S. military forces than direct combat. As a result, tackling malaria became a top priority for both sides of the conflict. In 1967, the Chinese government recruited to for a top-secret government program tasked with developing a cure for malaria. Under Tu's leadership, the group began to experiment with traditional Chinese herbs. Tu and her team searched through countless ancient texts, eventually finding a book from 400 AD that advised using sweet wormwood to treat intermittent fevers, a hallmark malaria symptom. After extracting the active substance from the herb, later dubbed artemisinin, Tu insisted on being the first human test subject. The trials were successful, and by the late 1970s, artemisinin was a standard malaria treatment across the world. In 2015, Tu became the first Chinese Nobel laureate in physiology or medicine. For saving millions of lives, Tu's discovery has been called the most important pharmaceutical intervention of the last half of the 20th century. It is for that reason, Tu Yu Yu is our 25th hero of progress.